shouldn't you be working on a video right now? Well, oh, technically. So are you going to, or... I've just been thinking about life, you know? There's gonna be a song, isn't there? Well, of course there's going to be a song. Well, you know, I just, I, I figured that when Erebus came over, there were three songs, so I thought maybe that would fulfill the quota for the first part of the year. Yeah, but those don't count. They weren't started by me. They were started by Erebus. And quite frankly, I do not appreciate him taking three songs away from me. So, you know, this has just got to happen. <sighs> oh, joy and rapture. You know, I used to be a grumpy Gus like you. Really? Oh, yes. I know it's hard to believe, but I wasn't always a fool, you know? So, that's your cue line? Nah. I worked hard to get this way. When I was a lad, I was gloomy and sad as I was from the day I was born. When other lads giggled and gurgled and wiggled, I proudly was loudly forlorn. My friends and my family looked at me clamorly, thought there was something amiss. When others found various antics hilarious, all I could manage was this, <laughs> or this, <laughs> My father, he shouted, he needs to be clouded, his teeth on a wreath, I'll hand him. My mother, she cried as she rushed to my side, you don't preach and you don't understand him. So they sent for a witch with a terrible twitch to ask if my future impressed her. She took one look at me and cried, <laughs> What else could he be but a jester? A jester? A jester? A funny idea, a jester. No butcher, no baker, no candlestick maker, and me with the look of a fighter to take her as a jester? As a jester? Now where could I learn any comical turn that was not in a book on the shelf? No teacher to take me and mold me and make me a merry man, fool, or an elf. But I'm proud to recall that in no time at all with no other recourses but my own resources with firm application and determination. I made a fool of myself. Bought a little gun, I learned to shoot. I bought a little horn, I learned to toot. Now I can shoot and toot. Ain't that cute? I started to travel to try to unravel my mind and to find a new chance. When I got to Spain, it was suddenly plain that the field that appealed was the dance. The Spanish were clannish, but I wouldn't vanish. I learned every step they had planned. The first step of all isn't hard to recall, cause the first step of all is to stand. And stand. And stand and stand and stand and stand and can I sometimes stand this way for days? And then they get very mad at the floor and begin to stomp on it. Here, let me show you. on the floor, and it hurts. Okay, yeah. Ah, so, mm -hmm. oh, uh, ah, uh. Okay. Okay. Note to self. Don't do that again. After all of my practice, the terrible fact is, I made a fool of myself. They decided that dancing as I did to sing was a thing that was sure. I found me a teacher, a crotchety creature who used to sing Kalalatura. She twisted my chin, pushed my diaphragm, and with a poker she vocalized me. When she said it was best that I threw on my chest, you may gather that rather surprised me. I was also on the ground till I suddenly found that in Venice I was to appear. The Galileo cow was a chopping canal and me a high sea gondolier. I nervously purchased the gondola lurched before the king's palazzo. As I started my song, my voice it was wrong. It was not so. Oh, so love me. Oh. oh, help! When I fell overboard, I was Majesty roared, and before a siesta, he made me his jester. And I found out soon that to be a buffoon was a serious thing as a rule. For a jester's chief employment is to kill himself. And a jester unemployed is nobody's fool. Gee, 
by the way, I'll have that video to you by Friday.